what's happening with everybody? We're just gonna continue to self-quarantine each other when we don't really need to. I know, and this is what I was thinking about too. Yesterday when I didn't feel good, I felt like out of it. Something was wrong. Like not sick, but just tired for some reason. You know, and fear will do that to you too. Fear changes your whole, how you feel, how you react to things, your reaction times. It makes you, your body not well, you know, and sometimes, you know, they use placebo pills. Think about that. Like they tell you, oh, you could be sick. It could be a common, you know, like you smokers cough, whatever, blah, blah, blah. You have Corona. It's fear. They're scaring people. It's working. Nobody's going anywhere. People are staying away from people. They don't want people gathering in groups talking about, wait a minute. Well, the flu killed like uh, five times as many people in one month period. It's not that many people are dying. Like, are they really worried about a huge spike here in the next week? That's what they're talking about. You know, like we haven't seen the worst of it yet. It's coming when everybody is sitting there incubation periods for 14, 21 days. That's when everyone's going to start getting sick and like it's gonna get really terrible. I don't know. Still don't know what to think. Everybody in the United States is just following along and, and getting a line on what the TV tells us to do and what our government tells us to do. Their plan is working perfectly. There's no resistance. They're just telling you there's this crazy thing that's killing people. Do you know anybody that's died from this? Anybody? They're not releasing any names, why? Is this a test run for like a real virus to see? You know, are they... It's really happening. But everybody's listening, everybody's obeying. They're all staying in their houses. They close everything down. There's no sports, there's no concerts, there's no anything. We're going back to the Great Depression here. Wait till the internet goes out, that's gonna be terrible. You want riots here, that's when they're gonna happen. People can't get on their phones. Oh my god, I can't update my social media profile. I can't watch my Netflix program. Oh my god. We better go smash shit. Oh, well, that'll be the next thing coming. I don't know, guys. Everybody's just being a good little sheep and following along. And whatever Big Brother tells them, that must be it. Like uh, one of the guys I follow, Richie from Boston, he said, Look, if you don't have the TV on and you're just out and about in your area... There's no virus. There's no nothing. It's a normal day. Like so, that's what I say when I'm driving around. It's normal out. It looks normal. Everybody. There's traffic. Stores are open. I mean, as soon as you turn on your TV, oh my God, everyone's gonna die. Stay in your house. You see what I mean? That's what they said. This virus is gonna spread through the eyes. Yeah, it's spread through the eyes. Through the eyes of you watching TV, watching social media, watching what everybody's telling you that you need to be doing. No. Why? Go out. <laughs> Nobody's sick. Look, I'm trying to keep everybody updated on what's going on in my town. Okay, that's all I'm trying to do. We'll see what happens in the coming days, the coming weeks. They keep extending how long this may or may not last. Um, so I don't know. You guys stay safe. Stock up on items if you can. If you can still go to your store. Um, you don't want to go outside and there's like National Guard Humvees on every single road and you can't drive and they tell you to turn around and if they catch you, they're going to make you do the test. Who knows? You don't want that. Go get your stuff now if you can. I'm not saying buy everything out of the store. I've said that a million times. Don't buy everything, okay? But get what you and your family may need, okay? Don't go crazy. If, you know, don't go crazy. But think, they're telling you to stop about toilet paper. Yeah, people need toilet paper, but you need water. Most of all, please, I'm telling you, fill stuff with water. Anything you can. Filled with water, empty containers, empty milk jugs, Gatorade containers. That's what I do. That's what we do. You don't realize how much you need water until you do not have water. Just wait. You can only go three days without water and you die of dehydration. <laughs> like, water is a huge part of your body. Water is a huge part of everything. Okay? So hopefully you guys listen. Get out there. Get your shit. Stay vigilant. Stay safe. I'll update you guys tomorrow.